Got to go to Michigan now, where the water contamination crisis has went. Uh, less, yesterday led to an, the top EPA official in that region offering her resignation. Uh, the agency, of course, has issued emergency orders. They're trying to resolve this water problem. With me now, trial attorney Hunter Skolnick. <laughs> Uh, with uh, from the firm of Napoli, Napoli, Napoli and Skolnick. Napoli and Skolnick, yes. Okay, Skolnick. Um, this is an absolute disaster. We know that. It, it certainly is. Uh, what we're dealing with here is a tragedy that's affecting the whole community. Uh, I would think at this time, at the very least, the EPA should be uh, losing its director in the area and moving forward. So now you're a trial attorney. Have you? Do you already have? People who who have come to you, they want to file lawsuits. Are you working on some kind of class action? What exactly is your role here? What we're doing right now, first of all, yes, we're, we're representing clients. Uh, our first client is a young girl, five years old, who has been tested positive for lead. Uh, it's a tragic situation for her family. Uh, it's a tragic situation for all the children. We're proceeding with the lawsuit on their behalf at this time. Is it just this one family hunter? Or are you going to open us up? To, I mean, obviously, this is a, an entire city. Exactly. Was exposed to this water. That's the problem. No, it's not just one family. We have been contacted. We have been retained by an excess of 35 families, young children across the community, and a lot more. What would the charge be? Uh, you've got a city that drove itself into the ground. The state had to come and rescue, and the state had to cut the had to find ways to save money. Was there? You can argue. Forget about the politics. I don't know that anything nefarious went on. Maybe some stupid things happened. But was anything? What would you argue in court? Well, to say nothing nefarious went on, I think, is understating the situation. What we have here is a change to the, to the system, the water system that occurred in April of 2014. To save money for a city that was essentially bankrupt. Yes, to save money, but within six months, they knew about the problem. They knew right. six months later, and they did nothing. They continued to hide it. That's nefarious. That's not just 